Hello and welcome back to Art Therapy with Jen. Today I have a art supply organization tip or hack for y'all involving these acrylic paints that you see me taking out of my bin there. These are inexpensive acrylic paints that I've picked up at Walmart over several months that I use in journal pages and other craft applications. And they're one of my go-tos just because of their coverage and just how inexpensive they are. But I was having an issue earlier in the day when I was doing some journal pages in that having them in my bin like I do there, I can't see at a glance what colors I have, what finishes they are. And sometimes the color dries a little bit different than what it actually looks like in the bottle. So I wanted to make it so I could just look and see exactly what I had. And to do this, I would take the cap off of each one, get a little bit of paint on my finger, and swirl a generous amount on top of the lid. This way I could see exactly what the color looked like once it dried down, what the finish was, and all that good stuff. It's been really helpful to me. And also, I'll tell y'all what too, this was a good way for me to go through my stash and make sure that all the paints that I had were still good. Because I had quite a few in here, funny enough, from the same set someone had given me. Almost all of them were dried up and they still had the seal on them. So that was just wild to me. I also had some that just did not smell good. <laughs> I went to open them up and they about knocked me over. So it was a good idea for me to go ahead and get them out of my collection. And know that everything I have in there is ready to put on a page or on a craft project. And here's what it looks like once I got them all dried and put on there. I love it. I can just look, see exactly what I have, and you can see there that the color in the bottle is quite a bit different than what is on the lid for a lot of them. And I think this will save me a lot of time and inspire me to put on more journal pages. And this would also be good if y'all have your paint stored in a drawer in a single layer. But thank y'all so much, and I will see y'all in the next one. Bye!